Hello and welcome to our video that will hopefully explain how you can use the University of Liverpool Library. We're going to take you through three different things today. First of all, we're going to show you how you can find academic journal articles using simple searches. Then we'll show you how to find the citing and referencing guide for your programme. And finally, we'll tell you who to contact if you have a problem with your library account. OK. So let's go ahead and look at the University of Liverpool Library homepage. We've included a link to this library in the Facebook post that accompanies this video. You can see here I've entered my username and password already. You should have created a username and password for the library already. If you haven't, then please let us know on the Facebook page and we can direct you to a video on how to register. Once you have your details, go ahead and log in. Okay, perfect. And now, first of all, like I said, we're going to do some searches for articles in the library. Now, as part of your studies, you'll often have to use the library to find work and material to help support your discussion questions and assignments. So if you want to do that, um, please enter the search term in the box. So let's try marketing, just for an example. Then click on peer review only. This will ensure that you only get good quality academic journal articles that have been confirmed as quality sources. Then click on search. Now this might take a little bit of time depending on the ability of your internet access and your connectivity. A new page opens and we have a list of search results here. So the first journal is called Seeding Strategies for Viral Marketing and Empirical Comparison. You can look through all the different options and then you choose one that you think sounds good. So for example, let us choose this one about dynamic marketing. If you think it sounds good and you want to read the full article, click on PDF full text just like I'm doing now. Again, it will take a little bit of time depending on the speed of your internet access. But eventually it will load the full text of that article and you can either save it to read later, maybe you can print it off if you prefer to read it when you're commuting, or you can just read it online right here. Now, if you want to learn more about citing and referencing, and you'll need to cite and reference all the articles you find in the library, you can do so by clicking on the referencing tab on the home page. Now you will have a different referencing style depending on which program you're studying. If you study law you will have um, the Oscola referencing style. If you study psychology or education then it's the APA style and for everything else including the MBA and all management programs it's the Harvard style. If you click on the style that you want to see here again it will take you to a PDF of um, all the information about the citing and referencing that you need to look through. Once again, you can save it, print it, whatever's most convenient for you. Now finally, if you have a problem with your library account, the quickest way to get that resolved is to contact the library directly. Once again, if you click on contacts, you will see that you can contact the library IT help desk either using a web form the help desk email address, or by telephoning them. If you have a problem regarding finding a particular article, then you can contact the librarian. Again, you can use the online web form for contacting the librarian. So the IT help desk would be for problems with your password or with problems with your account, and the librarian would be about finding particular articles. Okay, well done. So I hope that was helpful today and it gives you a bit of an idea of what's possible on the library. If you get any more questions, don't hesitate to contact your student advisor or let us know on Facebook. Thank you. Bye-bye.